Hi, this is Tim from Latest 3DS Games. Just here with a bit more information about the Nintendo 3DS Capture Card. And um, people have been asking about pricing, um, delivery, that sort of thing. So I just thought I'd kind of give you a heads up on all that. And I'll show you the link again to the site. So I've got mine from the US. There are a couple of other places that do do the 3DS Capture Card. In fact, there's one that now does a 3DS XL Capture Card. But I'm not going to put a link in for that one because I don't know anything about them. I will mention that in another video though. OK, and I also thought I'd quickly show you the difference of a before and after with Capture Card fitted. So this is my original purple 3DS, which I'm going to be selling to uh, kind of make up some of the cost that's been involved over the last few months. And uh, this is the one which is now fitted with a Capture Card. So you can see there just at the bottom doesn't look a lot, a lot different obviously the back plates come off capture card has been fitted in place and there's now a uh, USB slot there tiny one at the back and other than that it's identical so just to say you can uh, order the full Nintendo 3DS and you'll get everything obviously that you would get with your 3DS or you can just send yours in and uh, you can have the capture card fitted like so on the bottom and um, I ended up not sending my original purple one in because of customs uh, costs and things like that which I'll mention in a minute um, and I'm just going to show you the other things that you get with it regardless of whether you send in your capture card or not so here we go you get the noise filter that plugs into the um, front headphone socket and um, that is so you can record sound because it doesn't support sound by itself. You also get the USB cable and that links up to your computer laptop and um, obviously then you can start recording. You get links to the software and uh, so obviously it does kind of include software because it looks like it's all been written by the supplier and there's a support forum and things like that. The only other thing you need which you don't get is one of these which is a male to male cable now that goes in this the uh, noise filter just clips in there and uh, that goes to your PC line in socket and um, that means I think it costs a couple of pounds a couple of dollars and that means obviously you can then record sound separately so let's just talk about the cost so if you send in your own 3DS um, then um, It'll just be fitted and you'll get those other accessories I told you about and obviously the links to download the software. That's going to cost you $258, um, which isn't obviously cheap. But then obviously you can compare that to a capture card uh, for, you know, Xbox 360, a good one. And then obviously that's probably going to cost you $150 or so. And um, that converts over to, in the UK that's about hundred and seventy pounds so it's not cheap if you're in the UK Europe as well you will have to bear in mind you're probably going to get stung for import charges as well so you need to add on another thirty or forty pounds possibly even more it'll depend which country you're in okay and the full kit um, with the obviously the 3DS supplied as well is going to cost you four hundred and thirty three dollars that's around about £270, something like that, in the UK, and um, obviously the equivalent in Euros. Now, um, you're probably going to have to pay extra, for, a little bit extra for shipping as well, worldwide, for both of these packages. And so it isn't a cheap investment. And what you need to bear in mind, no matter which one you get, um, you are going to invalidate your warranty as well. So um, it is a serious thing to think about. You know, you're not going to have any warranty as such although I'm I'm told reliably that the guy who does it um, is very reliable and if you do have a problem he will replace or fix any problems that you might have but obviously you are invalidating your actual 3DS warranty so um, that's pretty much it for this video I'm going to show you another video very soon uh, on how to set it up in a basic setting and uh, record sound and also capture the images. So that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.